the over time calculations um, will be based on a monthly, uh, will be calculated on a monthly basis as opposed to every week or every day um, where uh, uh, nurses and doctors and all shift workers, because it's remember now it's not only applicable to nurses and doctors. This this affects all shift workers, attendants, uh, domestic workers, everybody that and, and might not necessarily only be at the Ministry of Health, but could be at from other ministries too. But the issue came up with the nurses, and so we have agreed with the Ministry of Finance that that calculation will will revert back to where uh, it was calculated monthly, so that not to affect uh, a nurse who works on a shift basis. Um, where they were being deducted hours if they did not <clears throat> complete the weekly <coughs> amount <coughs> according to what what the, the details were provided to us. Now, I think that with that out of the way, the other issue was the, the short hour deduction that was made this past pay period for the August 2022 payroll. That immediately sent um, Shockwaves, as I would put it, uh, across the medical profession. And I don't give the nurses or the doctors or any of these frontline workers, shift workers, who, as I said in that meeting to the Ministry of Finance, are feeling it in their pockets. Um, how can you expect these persons' uh, <clears throat> basic salary to be deducted and expect that, them, that they are to survive for the rest of the month? So my position and the ministry position, along with the Nursing Association of Belize, was that we revert that back immediately and that we reinstate those deductions. Uh, it was a very back and forth, uh, fruit, uh, very fruitful, however, where everybody understood. I know from the Ministry of Finance, <clears throat> we had um, people uh, that deals with the payroll system there and all that. They had the, the issues of technicalities and so that they believe that they had to we have to look out how, how are we going to ensure that it, it, it hits um, the, it's outside of the period already. So they had to look at options. And so at the end of the day, we agreed that these, all those persons that were the, had that uh, short hour deducted will be paid by no longer than the 9th of September. We're hoping that they can be paid by Friday. 